Yo, what's up guys, I'm back with another tutorial, in today's tutorial I'm going to show you how to make add-on weapons 5M ready. So first thing, what you want to do is you, you want to get a uh, weapon, in this case I'm going to be using the AR-15. Now with doing this, it is a replaced weapon, it's not making a whole new weapon in the game, it's just going to replace a weapon that's already in GTA 5. Um, as I said, this is making it 5M ready to work on your 5M server. So in this case, this replaces the carbine rifle. So once you get your weapon, doesn't matter what it is, what you want to do is you want to go into the file and this is what it's going to give you. Yours may be different and may not have less features. Um, so on these you will see uh, you got YDR, YDR files, I uh, should have YTD files. Yep, as you see there. Those are all your textures and what the gun's going to look like. So once you get all that file, that, that filing system there, what you want to do is create a new file. Now name the weapon. So whatever, wep whatever weapon name you want to go, in this case it's going to be an AR-15, so I'm going to do AR-15 for my weapon. Um, now once you do that, you want to create a new folder inside that folder. And you want to name it stream or lowercase. Once you're going to do stream, you want to kind of get them side by side. Um, in this case, I'm going to do long barrel version 2. I'm going to copy those over. Now I want to do the magazines, because I want the magazines to look good and correct for how the gun should look. So I'm also going to drag those over, and the rifle textures, so this should be just the rifle itself. So if you just want the rifle and you don't want any of the other stuff, then just drag over the rifle textures like so. Now if you want the other stuff, as you see I, I did that first, I've dragged them all over into the same folder there. So that's pretty well done, your weapon is halfway done. The only other thing you really need to do is you need to make an FX manifest.lua uh, document. Now, so if I open this, it's pretty simple, there's just two lines of code right here. These are the only two lines of code you're going to need. Um, so once you do that, you want to put it in, into that file. So if we go back here, so, yeah, copy and paste, I'm going to remove the two, so we don't actually need that. Xmanifest.lua, and that is pretty well done. So that, that, that's now done, this one here. Your gun's ready and you can just put it into the server now and it should work. Alright, so after adding the weapon to your server and restarting the server, uh, we're now going to give us this, give ourselves the weapon. Uh, so in this case, as I said, it's going to be replacing the carbine rifle. So what you want to do is give yourself the weapon carbine rifle. There we go. As you can see, I did have the M4A1 as my carbon rifle, in this case I have changed it. Um, so the picture and the, the name of this is incorrect for me. Um, but if we get it out, it may take a little longer to load. There we go. So it may take a little while to load. Um, unfortunately that is just how, how it works. Depends on how good your PC is, but in this case it has loaded. As you can see, it is custom. We now have the AR-15 in our server. Better look at that. There we go. If you enjoyed the video and it helped you out, uh, make sure to smash the like button, hit the subscribe button, and I'll see you guys on the next one. Um, in the next video, I will be showing you how to add the weapon to your OX inventory, such as changing the picture and the name.